The next half I'm extremely excited about. I've seen this gentleman light up stages from full packed theaters to the worst unattentive bar room crowds that he wins over with his majesty. He's rearing up like a beautiful horse on the plains right now. Everybody give it up for the musical comedy of Jay Gillespie. Yes. The question that I need you to ask yourselves right now is, are you willing to go on a journey with me. I met a girl. I met a girl. This doesn't happen very often. Wanted to get to know her. So I took her out for coffee. I asked her a whole bunch of questions and she talked and I listened. And with every word she said, I just kept hearing one thing that was red flag, red flag, red flag, red flag, red flag, red flag. Red flag red. I said, this girl's all red flags. She was like, my last boyfriend, he's in jail. He's a really violent dude. I go, why would you even tell me that? We're on a date. She goes, I was talking to him yesterday. I go, you were talking to your incarcerated boyfriend yesterday? She goes, yeah, why? She said, I was talking to him, and what he said is, the next guy that she dates, he's going to rip the arms right off his chest. I was like, baby, slow down. Oh, I'm hearing red flag, red flag, red flag, red flag, red flag. She was like, uh, hey, Jay, do you have any Coke? I was like, nope. I was like, red flag, red flag, red flag. And what was funny is I actually had a whole bunch of Coke. I just wasn't going to share it with her. You get it. Y'all have all done Coke. All right, this next song's for uh, Jean-Michel. It's for Michel Claude. Uh, it's for Claude Zachary, Zachary Pierre. Pierre Marc Paul, Marc Paul Jean. It's for Jean Zachary, Marc Paul Pierre, Pierre Claude. It goes like this. Uns, foi, tres, vieux, Canada! Canada! That's the second best country that's in North America. That's all they get. All right. I know what to do from here. I'm a professional comedian. It ain't easy making a living doing this. I'm not going to be putting any shoes on my kids' feet from this set tonight, and that's fine. I do it for the love. But when I get in front of a big, hot, and juicy crowd like this, I like to let you know about my side hustle. I like to let you know about the way I stack up that paper so that if you're in the market and if you're out there buying, and if you're out there doing this, I don't know, maybe, maybe my name pops into your head if you're in the market for a product. Because I'm Jay Gillespie. I'm a hot tub salesman. Hot tub salesman, need a hot tub? Get it from me, Jay Gillespie, I'm a hot tub salesman. And I have the best hot tubs in all of Denver, y'all! If you, if you want an inferior hot tub, there are plenty of places you can go. But if you want the best, I've got laminates in over 57 different colors, sir, plus patterns. I get a, a, a hot tub that looks like an American flag. What do you think is the normal temperature that a hot tub can get to? That's right, 140. Now my hot tubs, they can make it to an even 210. That's hot enough to cook a rabbit. You wouldn't even want it to get that hot. You can kill someone, but you need to have that option, okay? You wanna have that option. I've got jets that will shoot water out at over 37 different speeds. Oh, industry standard 16, that's right. What are some of the features that you look for uh, when you're in the market for a hot tub? I got that hot tub! I'm Jay Gillespie, I'm a hot tub salesman! Hot tub salesman, okay! Okay! I know what to do from here. She's like, hiya! And her ponytail is swinging. She's like, hi ya, she karate chops. I think that she's so beautiful. Hi ya, she front kicks. I think her name was Jessica or Patty or Michelle, but I'll be honest, it really doesn't matter. She's the hot girl in my karate class. She's the hot girl in my karate class. And in this dojo called life, she has a black belt in love. And I love her the way that Mr. Miyagi loves Yuki back in Okinawa. Listen, that was a pretty deep Karate Kid 2 joke right there. And if you didn't come along with me, I get it. This next song's not finished yet. It's got some holes in the chorus. I fill it in with the word something. Uh, you can fill it with whatever word you want. It really doesn't matter. The chorus sounds like this. Um, something, something, dildo. And something, something, dildo. Something, something, dildo. I said, wrecked him, damn near killed him first verse. Crowd work, hey, how we doing? Okay. 
We drink it, we're here at DOM. All right. Where are you from? Me too. What do you do for a living? That sounds like a whole lot of fun. All right, have a good time. Something, something, dildo. Something, something, dildo. Something, something, dildo. That's the wreck of damn you killed him. Second verse. Little Mermaid, here we go. Look at this stuff. Isn't it neat? Wouldn't you think my collection's complete? Wouldn't you think I'm the girl, the girl who has everything? Look at this trove, treasures untold. How many wonders can one cavern hold? Looking around here, you think, sure, she's got everything, and I do. I've got gadgets and gizmos aplenty. I've got who sits and what sits galore. Do you want thingamabobs, Andy? I've got 20, but who cares? No big deal. I want more. I want to be where the people are. I want to see, I want to see them dancing, strolling along. Da -da. What's that word again, where the cars go? What's that word? It's a street now. Flip in your fence, you don't get too far. Legs are required for jumping and dancing, strolling along on these. What's that word again? Where the shoes go? That's right, it's me. Up where they walk, up where they run, up where they stand all day in the sun, wandering free, wishing I could be a part of that world. Something, something, dildo. It's something, something, dildo. Okay. Okay, that's enough. That's enough of that. Let's do two more. I'm having a party. I'm having a party and you were invited. I want you all to come. I've got balloons. I've got streamers. There's gonna be food there. Bunch of hot girls gonna be there. Hot guys too, Janelle, hot guys too. Don't you worry about it. But I want this party to be memorable. And I want this party to be epic. So I got one special ingredient to set this party off. That's a methamphetamines. Methamphetamines. Crystal methamphetamines. Methamphetamines. I mean, in all honesty, is there a better drug to do if you want a party for like six days straight? There's not. It's the best one. And the cheapest. Methamphetamines. Okay. When I'm not here, I like to get out to the schools. I like to do some work with the kids. I show up, walk in the room, and I'm like, hey, children. And they're like, hey, Mr. J. And I'm like, how you enjoy it? Fourth grade. They're like, it's a lot of fun. I'm like, what are you learning about? He goes, shapes. I go, that's great. Do you like hamburgers? He's like, I love hamburgers. I'm like, do you like field trips? He's like, I probably like field trips even more than I like hamburgers. And I'm like, here's what we're going to do. We're going to load up in the van, and then we're all going to go to the slaughterhouse. All the kids are having fun at the slaughterhouse. And the butcher's name is Dan at the slaughterhouse. Why is there a train in the middle of the floor? Of the slaughterhouse, slaughterhouse, slaughterhouse. And Dan the butcher let a baby cow out by a rope. And he says, her name is Daisy. And all the kids, they gathered around. Pet her soft fur, and they said, oh, I love you, Daisy. <laughs> Daisy looked back up at them with her big brown eyes that seemed to say, I love you, too. My name is Daisy. And then Dan the Butcher took out a big knife, but he killed her. He killed Daisy because it's still a slaughterhouse. <laughs> All the kids are crying at the slaughterhouse. There is blood everywhere at the slot. Why is Dan laughing? That's crazy at the slaughterhouse. Hey, thank you so much. Let's get your host back up here. Oh, oh, oh boy. Let me just take a breath. Woo! Catch your breath, Daniel. Catch I need to catch breath. my breath. All right, we're going to be okay. I was just in the back. Oh, boy. Hey. Give it up for Jake Gillespie one more time, everybody. So, let's get into that musical mind of comedy. Uh, I've been doing this thing for like six or seven years, but I got a new pony I'm riding. Oh? That's right. And I'm going to bring my co-host up right now at the Jaguar Morning Show. This is Andy Jewett. You're let's bring here. up Andy Jewett. Come here. Talk about the Jaguar. Thank oh. you, Daniel. Tell these people what we do, Andy. Ladies and gentlemen, you just heard from my energetic 
partner, Jay Gillespie. We do a show here at Denver Open Media 57, and for you CenturyLink heads, 8009. Holler! That's right. We have a Jaguar morning show that starts Tuesdays and Thursdays, May 1st, from 9 to 11. We've been doing it in the afternoons. It's, it's your only 30-minute workout, news, weather, traffic, sports, religion, astrology, movies, and our patented top 10 list, patented of course. Patented top 10 list. And as Don't such, we're going to show a promo video here in a second to tell you a little bit what the show's about. But right now, we're going to... 10 isn't enough for this, a show this big. 10 isn't enough. Jay, let's do the top 100 animals. We're gonna All do 100. A, we're going to do a top 100 list for you right now. Number 100, to platypus. Uh, number 99, sea lion. Number 98 is a koala. Uh, number 97, no surprise here, salamander. Number 97, believe it or not, the tortoise. The votes are in. It's unanimous. Number 96, the worm snake. Number 96 is a gibbon. Number 95, narwhal. Oh, number 94, blue whale. Uh, number 93, uh, the macaque. Number 92, and we're just warming up right here, is a coral reef. That's a living creature. Number 91, we've got a long way to go. Hope you're buckled up. It's an ostrich from That's down right. under. Number 90, just eking it out, is an emu. Number 89, of course, no surprise here, a tapir. Number 88, give it up for America, the bald eagle. What number are we on? 87. 87, it's of course an aardvark. 87 is an aardvark. 86, your common gerbil. 85, a friend down the hall, it's the hamster. That is right. Number 84 is a, is a small household Number 83 dog. is a chihuahua. Oh, number 82, believe it or not, is going to be the uh, dolphin. 81 is a number... stingray, ladies and gentlemen. 81 stingray. That's right. Number 80 is a hermit crab. Number 79, a camel. Number 70. Yeah, any word from our friend, we are hold on. Let us stop. We can't hold this. Oh, this is the Jaguar Morning Show. Welcome to the Jaguar Morning Show. We thought we were so pumped to bring it to you. Uh, we go 30 minutes live workout, which we're about to do with these ladies, and then we do an hour news, weather, traffic, sports, religion, crime, books, and our patented top 10 list. Patented. And then the third segment is wake. The F up with Jay. Uh, this is how the show goes every time. Every time. So oh, she's double timing it, Andy. Oh, Keep you, up, Andy. Can you actually speed up? This oh, day? and you know, we're we're still gonna remain pubis focused. Yeah, we like to release the pubis. That's the big secret. It's the Jaguar Morning Show. You have catapulted into the second segment. Next headline, Jay. We are cranking through these guys. As you know, the Earth is flat. We are straight into what is what is possibly our favorite segment. The book segment. We read uh, uh, voraciously. That's right. These these inter interlocking rocks that you are creating, Elon, which is the future. We are getting right into the signs. It's time for Jaguar astrology. Mars is in retrograde. Yeah, I mean, Jay's been reading from the Quran a lot lately. Yeah. Uh, there's the Bhagavad Gita he's been getting into. I was like, oh. boom, 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 <laughs> As you know, one of the great emerging artists of our day, Danielle Bregoli. Oh, bad baby. bad baby. I know what a lot of these people are thinking right now. What have I been watching for the last hour and a half? It is time to do a little thing called Wake Up. You don't have the cojones to look inside the head of that monkey. It's like I always say, anyone can be taught to sing. There is no skill in singing. There's a hierarchy of morning shows, of, res of responsible journalism is a large part of what the Jaguar show is bringing to you. You gotta roll up the baby. You gotta roll up the baby. You got to roll up the baby. Baby. Let me tell you one thing about babies. They don't have the dexterity to murder. We'll see you Thursday for the Jaguar Morning Show. That's 30 minutes of workout. An hour of news, weather, traffic, sports, religion, travel, books, crime, and our patented top ten list. And of course, this segment, Wake the F Up with Jay. You're fully woken up now. Go out into the world and have a great time. Give it up for Jaguar, everybody. Wow.